Now, Dana, tell us about how you first learned about SWACA and how your organizations work together. Yes, so we first uh, met uh, SWACA through our share targeted population. SWACA traditionally targets seniors and seniors is one of our target population by virtue of being uh, 16 and older, uh, people also are at high risk for developing chronic diseases. So through uh, during our outreach in the community, we encounter with uh, a SWACR agent that were doing uh, diabetes uh, self-management. So we thought it was a natural um, uh, partnership here that we are preventing diabetes and they are doing diabetes self-management and uh, we start talking and see how we can work together. That's how we first encounter SWACA. As uh, since then, uh, that was in 2018, we have been uh, working with SWACA very effectively to help senior in, in Fairfield County. Thanks to the leadership of SWACA, uh, this relationship have, have been very fruitful for the past three years. Also, I would like to add that uh, in addition, we provide uh, our preventative care is not limited to seniors. We also provide uh, health education to uh, children of school age, teenager and young adults uh, uh, with the goal of reducing obesity and improving academic performance. As you know, there's a, a very compelling evidence that uh, nutrition is not just about health, uh, physical health, also, it's, uh, it's impact mental health and academic per performance. And we have been providing this, uh, this program to support families and children, particularly in low income area to help uh, with the, uh, with, uh, to reduce the rate of obesity and improve their, their academic performance. 